so this is the seat. Guys, welcome to the SL class. Here is the SL class. It's a really nice stick shift, actually. I love this stick shift. It's really pretty sweet, actually. It's just kind of the grip that you would have. It's pretty nice, actually. I like this a lot. So here it is. That is it. Nice sick design. No back to it, obviously. It's a two door car. It's a coupe. It's a coupe. I think it's French actually. Goop. It's fresh. Oh my god, you guys are in. You guys are all the way in the handle. Hello. And this is the dash. It's awesome. It's actually a really nice looking car. I'll show you the back and the front of it. Here is the car that we're buying. Okay. So we're buying. Not in this color, but this is the car. This is the sport edition of the E, which is a 2014 model. I like it. I actually kind of like it. It's kind of growing, growing on me, you know? This isn't the color that we're getting. It's growing on me. Okay. <coughs> so this is the car that we're buying. I think it's a really nice car, actually. It's kind of, it's really growing on me. This whole thing is growing on me. Yeah. Figured I'd give you guys a little bit from the passenger seat. This is growing on me. Let's see. Oh, that's, uh, I don't know, actually. I think ours are not like that. I'll double check on my car. I like this, though. It's, it's starting to grow on me. I'll be honest. <laughs> going on me. Oh, by the way, that's the electric. That's the electric car right there. That's a really nice view of it. Um, here are all the three C's right here. That's the luxury. Uh, that's the luxury, actually. That's the, uh, like, right in the middle between the sport and the luxury. That's the, the classic or whatever they call it. That's the sport. Uh, the next to me is another nice car. Uh, I think that is an S-Class, I'm actually not exactly sure, but it's a pretty nice car either way. And here, right next to me, is the wagon. that. And then there are a couple more nice cars. They do a really nice job with their cars here. And, uh, personally, I love it. Oh, I actually kind of never noticed that they had their cars up here. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome. Side charge for the electric. So, as you can tell, I'm currently sitting in the CLA class. Um, I kind of like it, actually. It's not too bad. Uh, it's got a really nice, sleek design. It's 2015, I can't tell. Um, this is a 2014. Uh, I like it. It's not too bad. The seats are actually really cool. They're really comfortable, too. That's the back. It's really nice looking, actually. I like it a lot. So here is a 2014 C300. If you guys kind of wanted to see the difference, it's really different. They have a totally, totally different design on this car. Um, actually, this one still has a stick shift. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, I think this is a sport. Um, I like it, though. I think it's really nice. It's a little bit different. We've got the whole shebang up in the back. I like it, though. I think both of them are nice. I really do. Stick shift. And the front wheels. I think it's like weird. Currently I am in the S550. I'm gonna be totally honest and put this shit out there. I don't like anything about this car. I think it's really weird. Weird design. I don't like it. I think it's ugly. Sorry to say. Here's the control panel. I just don't find anything 
cool about this design. I'm sorry. I just don't like it. I'll show you guys the outside. Um, the only thing I think is kind of cool is the seats. That's really it. <laughs> Here's also the back of the control panel. I think, I think it's just a weird looking car and personally I don't like it. So I'll show you guys the back. 2015 uh, GL model. Uh, same size. A little bit different. Everything's kind of glazed over now. Uh, of course, seats in the back. There you go. It did a nice job with this. I like it. Now everything is glazed over, sadly. But uh, I like that model more. <laughs> the 2015 ML, which is actually a really nice design. Uh, again, everything's glazed over, of course. Uh, did a really nice job with this, actually. The seats are really different, too. You have this uh, nice texture on the seats. Which is kind of cool. Uh, this isn't so different, but they did a nice job with it. And... Here's the back. Here's the front of it, rather. I am in the GL uh, GL 450, and uh, it's got really, uh, a lot of natural woods to it. You know, let's see if I can focus on it. Yeah, so it's got a lot of natural woods to it, and nothing is glazed over. I uh, did a really nice job with this, actually. Uh, I like this car, actually, quite a lot. Uh, wheels are pretty much the same. Uh, again, a lot of natural woods, nothing is really glazed over. I like the matte finish that they have. They did a really nice job with this car, uh, car actually. This is the larger of the GL model, and uh, it extends in the back. And it's really nice, actually. I like it a lot. Did a really nice job with this. And uh, yeah, pretty much control panels are pretty much still the same, but they did a really nice job with this stuff. So currently I am in the GLK model, which is my favorite of the larger cars. And uh, you'll see why on the outside. They've changed the exterior a little bit. I like it a little bit less, but it's I, I, I think this is kind of weird, but uh, that's probably changeable. Um, I like this car a lot though. It's got a really nice size, it's got a really nice sleek look to it, and um, I will show you the outside right about now. That's kind of cool actually. The control panel on the side. It's actually kind of cool. Yeah. Currently I'm sitting in the CL5550, uh, and it's actually really different. I've actually never seen this car before. Uh, I don't know why, but I haven't seen this car ever. Uh, it's really nice. Uh, I like it. It's not too bad looking. Huh. It's cool actually. Where the trunk is just a little bit bigger, and I actually kind of like it. Uh, they did a really nice design with this one. Currently, I'm sitting in their sedan. I've actually never sat in the sedan, but their uh, the looks of it has gotten quite nicer. I actually never really liked the sedan. Um, it's basically an E, as you can kind of see here. It's basically an E only uh actually this is a little bit different. this is what we have in our car now by the way um it's basically an e only this is a little bit different uh this is a 2014 model uh it's an e like i said only with a much larger trunk which i will show you right now not too much of a difference so here is uh this is a little bit different um this wasn't here uh this was like up here and then this was like textured uh, in our car, uh, this is the same, just this is now wood, which I, I like it, it it's got a nice grip to it, but uh, here's also the different, uh, the control panel, it's a little bit different, this isn't here on our car, uh, this is a little bit different, it rides a little bit different, uh, it's a nice car though, I like it, it's, it's pretty nice looking, it's pretty nice looking, uh, this is also a little bit different, this is a little uh, sleek looking, um, it's nice though. Uh, let's see. Here we have. Uh, okay, that's the same size. That's cool. <coughs> the arms are a little different looking. Uh, they've got the. Uh, they've got the whole. They've got the texture there. Uh, there. Uh, yeah. So I like it. I like it. This is a nice job with this actually. This is also a little bit different. It's kind of cool. Uh, it wasn't outlined as it is now. Uh, and yeah, it's pretty much it. This is a little thinner. Uh, they did a nice job though. Uh, the pedals are the same. And uh, overall, I actually kind of like it. It could take a little bit of getting, getting used to me, but uh, I like it. They did a nice job with it. This is all the same. <laughs>
like, yeah, they did a nice job with it. Let's look at the uh, uh, exterior. All right, so currently I'm sitting in the E, yeah. the 2014 E, which is actually the car that we're buying. It's not that I don't like it, it's just, you know, I'm very happy with the car at the C. It's a really nice design, it's, it's really sleek, but uh, here is the uh, other parts of the interior that we have in our E2014. everything in between. It's also got the uh, stick shift, the uh, gear shift, which is the little weird pedal thing, uh, but it's awesome and I really like it. Guys, so currently I am actually in their electric car, which they uh, currently design from uh, using with Tesla's um, energy design as well. They're trying to make their gas mileage more efficient. Uh, it's a government standard now and uh, here it is. It's got a pretty nice design. It has kind of like the design of the car that I have now, which is the E. And it's actually really nice. I'm going to show you the trunk in a minute, but I'll show you the front as well as well as the back. And uh, here's also actually the sides. It's really nice. It's really, really nice. They did a really good job with this car. I actually really like it. And here's the grill of the luxury. Here is the grill uncle stand on the exterior of the sport. Here I am in the C Sport model, where again, it's really different, but it's a very, very nice car. As you can see, the back is definitely a little bit different, and now I'm going to show you the exterior of the cars. Currently, I'm sitting in the C standard model, which has the features of both the uh, C uh, standard, uh, the C luxury, and the C sport. And uh, again, I like both cars. It's really, really nice. Here is the front of the 2015. Looks really awesome. Side. It's really nice looking, actually. What's going on, guys? So currently, I'm sitting in the 2015 Luxury C Class. I wanted to show you this earlier. This is the luxury, and I like it. So I'm at my other dealer, and this is actually the GLA 45. I've never ever seen this car. I think it's kind of cool. Chunk opens up, of course, uh, and this kind of goes up with it. Uh, it's kind of cool. This function, this is like the whole. It's kind of cool, actually. I'll show you guys the uh, interior as well. As here we have our lovely tail that's coming together. That's it. Locks. A little more of an oval type gas. Here is the back. I want to see the room in here. It's a little bit smaller. More like a sedan. Oh shit, these seats are fucking hard. <laughs> it's got kind of like that sports sedan feel. You know, you can fuck with someone's head over here. Uh, here's the front. A little bit. Here is the front. Uh, it's kind of cool, actually. I kind of like this. That's cool. That's pretty cool looking, actually. I've actually kind of—I've never seen this car. Let me just tell you that first. Uh, let me tell you that straight up. There's not so much room in the back. Uh, and here's the front. There you go. Alright, so this is the front. I showed you just a minute ago. And uh, actually, the windows are closed when uh, we go to Huntington. And uh, here's the front. Uh, it's pretty nice looking. Uh, of course, you got that awesome, pretty sweet gear shift right here. I like these gear shifts. You know, uh, this, is, this is pretty cool. I like the design of this one. Right when you hold it. Kind of got that natural feel on this. Yeah, I like this one actually. I like the other one too that I saw our other uh, dealer. This is the flat rim, or flat wheel, flat bottomed wheel, I like to call it. Uh, we have our new screen here, and this is the top. It's a really nice looking car actually. It's a little bit small, it's kind of the mix between the smaller car and the bigger car. Uh, I kind of like the look of it, and uh, I'm going to go out and show you guys the front. Huh. So I'm in the S550, and this one, this dashboard, it's fucking electric. This dashboard is damn well electric in this S550, and it's really sick, actually. Um... 
I love this car now. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. It's fucking electric. That's so sick. Well, as you guys can tell, I'm a total car freak. Um, sadly, we lost the deal on our car that we were going to buy. So, uh, look at that hair. <laughs> we lost the deal on the car that we were going to buy. So, we don't really know what we're going to do now. Um, I bought a card. Like an iTunes gift card. Sorry, I'm super stuffy. I don't know why. I bought an iTunes gift card. And it's like... It, it's broken. I redeemed it and everything. It's got like infinite money or something. Because I bought like six albums. Like worth of stuff. And um... It, I keep buying stuff. And it's not like stopping. I don't know why. Lucky bitch. Good night guys. I know I said I was going to come out with another video of like gay stereotypes or something. I'm going to do that. Um, I promise I'm going to do it. <laughs> I'm not a liar. I'm going to do it, but not right now. Uh, I'll come out with it in about a week or so. I'm a bit busy, so. Alright guys, good night. And I'll talk to you maybe in a couple of days.